What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel and uh, today we got our motor mounts finished up. I'll turn the camera around. I'll let you guys check that out and uh, after that we're going to get on to the transmission mount and uh, yeah first things first motor mounts motor is actually bolted into the frame so it's time to do the happy dance. <laughs> Okay guys, so I didn't really uh, record any of the welding of the second part of the motor mounts, but uh, there they are. I'll uh, set up a, a photo montage that you guys can check out. <laughs> motor is actually bolted in so that's a huge huge milestone the cab is sitting on the mounts where they're supposed to sit cabs not bolted down yet because we're constantly lifting it up and down there's the motor mounts again from this angle and so what we're up against here now here we got the cross member from the 99 f350 which fits the frame, but doesn't fit this transmission. Right now we got the transmission sitting on the stock Dodge cross member. The cross member is bolted to the transmission right now. So what my plan is, is we're going to frank and hack the two together. I'm gonna cut this guy down right about here, right about there. And uh, we're going to get those pieces mounted to the frame and uh, see where we can tack weld it. And then we'll build some gussets across to the other or plating or whatever we got to do uh, to make that thing strong. And uh, so without further ado, let's get a cutting. <laughs> okay, guys, so here we are under the truck. And uh, if you can see these three holes... Those are the three holes that uh, this original Ford cross member was mounted on for the V10. And uh, there's also three other placements that you can place it. So we're going to uh, bolt it on there and we're gonna get some measurements and then we're gonna cut this so it's a lot truer and uh, weld that guy up. And so it'll act like the Ford cross member where the one side will go in and then the, this side will come up. That one bolts on the inside of the frame. This one bolts to the outside. Uh, there's lots of play here, like five inches of slide back and forth. So uh, we'll be able to get it to line up with one of those holes as well as square it up with that. So let's get this bolted on there and then we'll get this, this, uh, this piece cut to the correct angle. Okay guys, so after I had those two pieces cut and seeing it sitting in there, I figured just tacking that together and whatever would just look like trash. So uh, we did so nice on the motor mounts and everything. So what we're gonna try and do here is I'm gonna make a cardboard cutout here to uh, make a, a bracket here that maybe I can just cut myself so I don't have to send it away and uh, make some brackets like that and then weld in some supports and stuff because this just would look like trash. There's too many elbows and bends going on. So uh, I'm going to get my cardboard out and make some templates and see what we can come up with. 24 hours. 
Okay guys, it's uh, the second day here working on the transmission mount. Um, I know you can tell uh, because of my wardrobe changes that I have between day and day, but uh, we got the transmission mount done and I'm just gonna climb under the truck and we got it all bolted in there and we're gonna let you check it out. So I'll also run like a, a photo montage of uh, some of the bracketry and stuff that I did. Um, so. I'll let you guys see all that stuff. And so let's climb under the truck and check it out. So there it is, it's all bolted in. We uh, made some brackets here, these guys here, and uh, we utilized some of the frame that we cut out up here. We utilized that, had a nice uh, 90 degree bend there. So uh, that's how they look. Transmission is bolted in. I need to get bolts here. These are just loosely sitting in here. Uh, I don't have long enough bolts, need six and a half inch bolts there. Uh, but those will get here right away. And uh, the other side there, if you guys can see there. So pretty much the hardest thing about all of that was actually drilling into the frame up here. Um, it was super, super hard to push um, laying on the ground here, but uh, we got her. So the transmission and the engines sitting in place uh, where it needs to be. So there's the back of the transmission sits uh, right behind the cab here. And we got a, a line here where it needs to be. And that's all nice and centered there, as you guys can see. And uh, I'll show you inside the cab here. So there's the transmission sticking through the floor. And I'll just show you some of the clearances here. So we got clearance on the back firewall, clearance on the valve cover, clearance on the transmission in there. So nothing's rubbing or touching and uh, I couldn't have asked for more. How it's uh, all lining up and how it's sitting in there. And we got our fancy motor mounts again. So I'm fairly happy the way things are going. The truck can roll back and forth. Everything's bolted in. Can go on the hoist if I want. So there it is. That's a big step. Okay guys, so that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, couldn't be happier. The engine's bolted in. Transmission's bolted in. Uh, all the cross members, the motor mounts, all that's done. Um, I don't know the next step where I'm going to go. Uh, I'm going to think about it for a couple days here. Um, there's lots to go. There's rad support, rad intercooler, all that stuff. Uh, gas tank, fuel lines, uh, clutch, hydraulic clutch, brake booster, uh, steering shaft, all that stuff. Um, lots to go. Uh, so I'm going to think what my next move is. Um, haven't really thought further. Just super pumped that my truck is sitting here with the engine in, can roll it back and forth without uh, having to lift the engine in or out or support it with wood or whatever else. So uh, super pumped that we've made this milestone. And if you guys can do me a huge favor, subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up, hit the bell so you know next time I'm dropping a video, it's about once a week uh, if I get time to work on the beast. Uh, anyways, without further ado, peace. That's gonna be it for this episode. So if you guys can do a huge favor, smash the, the thumbs up and subscribe to my videos, and to my channel, I mean. Idiot. That's gonna be it here. Idiot.